Hey guys, Red Jerry 2 here. Uh, you like the new do? Uh, hopefully, whenever it grows in, I'm gonna have a very luscious, awesome mullet. But um, this is gonna be the last update for the FX racing chassis. And um, unfortunately for some, but good for me, um, it is no longer there. So um, I actually sold it, I put it up for sale, I painted it, which I'll show you some clips of. Here's the FX racer as it sits, all freshly painted. And uh, unfortunately I don't have it out in the sun yet. Actually someone's on their way to come look at it to buy it. I posted it for 500 or best offer, which there's a lot more money in parts in this thing than just $500. So um, I'm going to hurry up and try and dig it out of the garage because before he gets here and hopefully I can get a video of it out in the uh, yard before he gets here. I don't really like uh, shoving cameras in people's faces that I don't know. So um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Unfortunately, I don't have any riding clips. I don't have any anything like that. Real nice kid came. I posted it for $500 or best offer. I was willing to trade for partial trade for uh, Briggs V Twin Vanguard horizontal or vertical shaft, uh, Peerless 820, and a couple other things. And uh, this kid messaged me and uh, he came out. Uh, we settled on $370 and a. Uh, 18 horsepower uh, horizontal shaft V-twin. Hopefully he enjoys it. Uh, I definitely would have if I would have kept it. It was one of those projects that it was in the garage for way too long. I got sick and tired looking at it, sick and tired working on it. So um, I hurried up, got it together, and I need more room in the garage for new projects. Yeah, that 18 horsepower is going to go on the Sears Killer whenever I bring that home to redo it. Um, it needs a rear axle. I have the rear axle, but I need to put seals in it. And uh, I would like to lock it. And then I'm going to throw that 18 horsepower onto there because I believe it's only a 14 horse. Yeah, so the Sears Killer is going to be back up in action hopefully within the next couple months. It's going to be uh, bigger and better. I got new tires for it. So, um, yeah, so I'll show you these couple clips of the FX Racer. Unfortunately for some of you, you might miss it, but it's gone uh, on to bigger and better things. And maybe I'll build another racer here pretty soon. There it is, all done up. It's gonna suck to see her go, but uh, this is one of those projects that's been in the garage for so long that you get so sick and tired of looking at it, even though it's an awesome machine now that I've redone it. Redidded it, but um, yeah, it's just one of them things that you got to move on. You got to make room for new projects. <laughs> 